Hello boys and girls, it's Fog, and you are looking at Fog's Magic Triangle. So I was working on a build and I had a specific need for a certain type of circuit, and I played around with some different configurations, and I kind of stumbled upon this. And I've never seen this done before, but, uh, you know, maybe somebody has stumbled upon this before, but I've never seen it. And uh, I, I'm just, I love the symmetry. And it happens to do exactly what I wanted. And see if you can guess what it is. When I throw this switch, after a short delay, that light comes on. And if I turn the switch off, the light immediately turns off. If I play with the switch a little bit, it's hard to tell, but that light doesn't change until the switch has been on for a set amount of time, no matter how many times I flick that switch. So what this is, is it's a instantly resettable timer. Pretty neat, huh? Super easy to build. Let me show you how you do it. Uh, you just build, basically just build a pyramid or a triangle or whatever you want to call it out of whatever your material, whatever material you want to use. And then, whoops, and then knock out every other block like this and then put repeaters in here going one way and then the other on each level and you can change the timings on these repeaters to be whatever you want let's set these to the max on that one I left them at one tick just because uh, I wanted the effect but usually you'd set these to four ticks or something so you get a long enough delay um, then you need to put either glowstone or half slabs, you know, top slabs will work, or uh, upside down stairs, anything like, anything that has that same property that glowstone has, and build another pyramid that's one shorter than your other pyramid. Knock those out, just like before. In this one, you fill the gaps with redstone, and fill the tops with redstone as well, just like this. just like that. And then go ahead and put a torch on every one of these blocks in here. Probably should have done that earlier, but you can do it whatever order you want to do it. Now, for the last step, any block at the end of your pyramid that is ha is being pointed to by a repeater, put a dot of redstone on it. Just like that. And there and now you're basically done. The output is right here and it needs to be inverted usually depending on what you're going to use it for. I mean obviously if you want the output to go low after a set amount of times you don't need to invert it. And the input is this block right here or you know wherever you started your repeater chain. And then when you throw the switch after a set amount of time your output will turn on. And the minute you turn the switch off the output goes off. The reason this works is that glowstone can have redstone dust placed on it, but it doesn't, ex doesn't itself actually conduct redstone power. Furthermore, it doesn't break redstone connections like this as long as the redstone power is traveling up in the circuit. So this redstone down here can pass power to this redstone here, which in turn can pass power here. So what you end up with here is a gigantic ore gate made out of all this glowstone, where if any of these torches is on, this redstone right here at the top will be powered. All right, now those of you who are particularly observant will notice that uh, you don't really need this many torches. Um, like if you look here, this, this repeater here is pointing to this block and this glowstone is feeding back to this block. So this block and this block will both turn on at exactly the same time. So you really only need one of these two torches, you know. But I like putting them all on there because it it looks symmetrical and it looks kind of neat. So there you have it. Fog's magic triangle. Or in other words, an instantly resettable timer. Anyway, thanks for watching, and we'll talk to you again next time.